Rachel Rouge was a Dutch artist who was known for her still life painting as a flower. She was born in the Hague, Netherlands on the 3rd June of 1664. One of the 12 children, she was born into a wealthy and prominent family. They moved to Amsterdam when she was three. Art historians consider Rouge to be one of the most talented still life artists. Among both men and women, she had a strong understanding of drawing and the techniques of earlier tradition. This knowledge improved her painting's abilities. She paid extensive attention to all details in her work. And every petal was created painstakingly with delicate brush work. The background of Rouge's paintings are usually dark, which was the fashion of her flower painting in the second half of the 17th century. Her asymmetrical composition with drooping flowers and wild stems created paintings that seemed to possess a great energy about them. Rouge enjoyed a great fame and reputation in her lifetime. When she died in 1750, 11 poets paid their respect with poems about her. In the 17th century, the Dutch were very interested in flowers and gardening, so paintings of that highlighted. The beauty of nature were highly valued. This helped to build and main Rouge throughout her career. In her lifetime, her paintings were sold very high price, up to 750 guilders. The first artwork is Flowers in a Glass Vase with a Tulip. The artist's name is Rachel Roish. The date it was made was in 1716, and the medium that was used for it is oil on canvas. The dimensions are 46.5 cm by 36 cm. The second artwork is Flowers in a Vase. The artist's name is, again, Rachel Ruish. The date made was about 1685, and the medium that was used was oil and on canvas. The dimensions are 57 cm by 43.5 cm. Produced more than 250 paintings over seven decades. Her works were in great demand and she achieved widespread fame and received international recognition. Considered one of the most successful artists of her day, contemporary Dutch writers called her Holland's art prodigy and our subtle art heroine. In 1693, Ruish ma married the portrait painter Hurriem Poel. As well as producing a large family of 10 children, they each enjoyed a thriving art career. In 1701, they joined the Guild of St. Luke's, an organization that regulated and promoted the work of artists. Ruish's style of painting and choice of subject rarely changed throughout her career. Her flowers seem to glow with an inner light, even though their delicate petals and overgrown blooms show signs of the ravages of time.